star-forming regions and galaxies. It sees light from electrons in the Milky Way. We can remove that light from the image. It sees radio emission from the Milky Way. We take that light out. It sees light from dust in the Milky Way. We can remove that light. When we take all of those other sources of light away, we're left with the cosmic microwave background itself, the oldest light in the universe, traveling towards us for 13.8 billion years and showing us the universe in its infancy. A brand new discovery from, from these observations is that we have detected the era where the very first stars in the universe ignited. And this era was, uh, for many, surprisingly early. It's only about 200 million years after the Big Bang from, from the time that you had this intense uh, concentration of, uh, of all kinds of exotic particles, the time when gas clouds could form and condense and form stars. So we, we've, we've detected that era for the first time, and, and it is very early. Well, because it takes the light over 13 billion years to reach us, we are seeing now what the universe looked like then over 13 billion years ago, so it's a, it's a fossil remnant of, of what the early universe was like, and just uh, like fossils are used to study the past, we use this light to study what the universe was like uh, way back 